Tom, so glad to have you with us, man. Love all the stuff you have going on. It's been a pleasure being connected with you, and I very much value and appreciate what you do for our community. Um, here on Reinvention Daily, everyone's here to question right now. What's one thing you've had to reinvent? So for me, um, in my experience as chief experience officer for my uh, recovery treatment center, um, the thing that I've really had to in, uh, reinvent is the collaboration of communication between those on their journey of recovery and those who um, are closest to them, their relationships with their loved ones and their family members. Uh, that's been the real thing that I've had to uh, reinvent because I've seen so many people suffering right now due to you know, the, the environment that we're in. Uh, a lot of people are suffering in isolation and they're not um, receiving that support that they've, they've had in the past. So what I've had to do um, is reinvent and look deeply at that relationship um, in the world recovery uh, connection intimate connection with, with those you care about is so vital. Absolutely, my friend. It's all about connection right now. I think you nailed it perfectly. And, and, and I, I deem you as someone who is a guiding light for so many people. And I think just honing in on that connection is, is huge. And there's so many people in this world that are suffering. And, and to have you and to have you and your team be that guiding light and that, that resource, that is exactly what we're looking for, my friend. And I applaud you and I very much appreciate what you do and it, and it leads us to our next question man is is you know what's the new conversation that you want to start tom as we move forward yeah so number one the negative stigma associated with addiction uh, unfortunately andrew 90 percent of us are touched by addiction i know that if you paused for just a second you can think of at least two people in you in your life that you know they're suffering from some sort of addiction um, whether it is a chemical, whether it's um, a mentality, um, it, addiction is part of all of our lives. And so I would like to help remove that negative stigma, help those who are in addiction to, to get rid of that shame, because shame will not produce the fruits of, of uh, change in life. And I want people to know that they're not alone. Uh, number two conversation I'd like to, to facilitate and, and encourage is those who are loved ones of those who are suffering from addiction, they are going and have gone through hell. And what I want to do is to help facilitate a conversation and support with them and say, you're not alone. There are resources, there are people who understand the hell that you've gone through and I want to help support them as well. Because if someone who's in recovery gets well, but their family members don't get the support that they need, it does not provide for a perfect environment for someone to be able to fully recover. They may fall right back in because they're placed in a similar circumstance.